So virtual day is an option that the Indiana Department of Education allows schools opportunities to do virtual days, which means that instead of being at, in the actual physical school building, students can do work outside of the school building. So the way virtual days kind of operate is um, the principal decides what a virtual day can be used, which we will have our first one on what day? Wednesday. Thanks. Wednesday next week um, for parent-teacher conferences. So the way that it will work is your teachers will assign you work through Google Classroom or through email of what you're to work on during the times of operation, so from 8 to 3. Um, the teachers have to be available to you um, through email for at least two hours here at Bishop Knoll. So for example, if I'm a teacher and I send out my email um, at 8 a.m. Um, with what you have to do. You guys will work on the work and then if you have questions you email me between my hours of operation which will be 10 to 12. So you can email me whatever and then I have to respond to you during that time. So um, this is our test run um, and this is an effort to give the teachers a day to really focus on parent-teacher conferences um, and, and that's what a virtual day um, kind of is and the start. This will be our first opportunity to kind of work out any kinks we find. Yes, um, the DOE has given us permission for six days um, no, I don't know when we're going to use them yet. Um, I know that our first snow day will be a virtual day, so instead of us losing the day where we have to make it up at the end of the year, we can actually um, email you your assignments, do your work, etc., um, and it doesn't count against us on our DOE reports, which is Department of Education. So um, those will be used, um, and I think I have one in February, but I don't know the exact dates, but um, the goal is to use these as long as it's effective and our students are still learning during the times of um, the work that they have to do. Um, as a student, um, you guys always want dress down day, so you get to wear your pajamas if you want during a virtual day. Um, you could wear holy jeans on virtual days because you're not in school. Um, as far as expectation, the expectation is really you're going to have a full day's worth of work, so you really don't get out of anything. Um, it's just an opportunity for you to kind of maybe watch some videos on Khan Academy, do some work, etc. It's just a different form of learning um, that will take place those days um, and really in the comfort of your own home. If you don't have Wi-Fi access, um, that's where some of our students uh, may, may have some issues. Um, a lot of um, places such as McDonald's um, and stores now offer free Wi-Fi. So students need to figure that out before Wednesday of where they can get access to wireless. And how will you check attendance? Um, <clears throat> it's a great question. Um, whoever turns in their assignments the next day, they were in attendance. I think I have to figure that out. <laughs> I'll figure that out before Wednesday. <laughs> Miss Ackerman, how are we going to do attendance? <laughs> come on, Miss Ackerman, come get a debut. Okay, yeah, we don't have to take attendance here through Miss Ackerman, so we'll just have to figure that out um, some form digitally. Maybe I'll have to take a picture of you guys and you'll have to send it to me or something. I'll be on that soon. Okay, thank you. All right, thank you guys.